I'm just me, you know, I'm always like doing my thing. The biggest modeling sensation of the new millennium came out of the Southern Hemisphere and can be summed up in just one word, Giselle. I think it's very great that, like, that you do a job and you get recognized in your job. I think everybody likes that, so I'm very happy. But for my personal, like myself, it doesn't change anything. I'm just me and, you know, this is just good for my career, but it's cool. Giselle Bunchen led the pack with an endless array of campaigns, hundreds of shows, and countless achievements. Yes, check this out. <laughs> I was very excited when they told me I was doing the Rolling Stones cover, and I said, hey, sure. They had like three models in the whole history of Rolling Stones, you know, doing the cover, so it's a very big honor for me. Always at the top of her game, Giselle remains an industry favorite. Giselle is um, just one of those rare rarities in, in this industry where she's smart. Not only is she dropped and gorgeous and has one of the most incredible bodies I've ever seen, and she's extremely professional. This small town girl with a body beyond compare seemed destined for stardom very early on. My name is Giselle, like I'm, I'm from Brazil. A south is a small city in south of Brazil in the countryside and I'm 17. The guys from Elite in, in Brazil, they found me there in the shopping center with all these girls and they took me and they said, okay, so now I'm gonna be a model. And, and then he put me on the contest, Elite contest. And, and then I did it and then I, I take second place and then I, and I didn't want to do it in that time that I went just back to school, I didn't, I didn't care. And just like in one year ago, I just say, okay, let me try. <laughs> the best part, like, is my favorite thing to do is always shows. Because I think it's so much fun, it's so much energy, it's always different. Like, you see this show, it's like unbelievable. Giselle has a body that you've never seen before. It's kind of like drop dead gorgeous. I think it's nice that they changed that from like really skinny girls from like to go now from like more what a woman looks like. You have to feel for Giselle. If there's a bra anywhere in the vicinity of a fashion show, the poor girl has to wear it. Giselle increased her icon quotient when she signed a mega contract with Victoria's Secret in 2000. And by 2006, she was reportedly the face of 20 brands, earning $30 million a year. Life is full of opportunities and whenever they come to you, if you feel like you should take it, you should take it.